the TBWS Daily in Stereo. Yo, 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 bringing you your real estate and lending news from the TBWS platform on the mic is Brian Stevens. Frank Gray. Man, we are nerds. Pretty much. Listen, one of the group that doesn't see any problem with robo-signing MERS and the testimony of the big four up on the hill is Moody's. Uh. In fact, come to think of this, guys, they're anything but Moody on the topic. Mm -hmm. They believe that the exposure to risk is extremely low to moderate. Okay. Yoda Forrester of Moody's said, and yes, that's his name. Okay. Or almost it. He said, a material residual of cases where practical proof issues and judicial frustration may stymie and prevent foreclosure. Translation! In only a very few cases will foreclosures be delayed or stopped at all. Why didn't he just say that? I don't know. Further, with regard to MERS, Yoda said, even if MERS doesn't have a standing to foreclose in its own name, MERS can assign the mortgage to the RMBS Trust, which through the servicer may then foreclose. Once again, Frank, translation! Psst, don't even trip on MERS. <laughs> that's not what they said, do you think? I think that's what they're trying to say. Okay, what's the problem with Moody's position? Okay, well here's the problem. Moody's and the boys fail to acknowledge the issue of a broken chain of title through the system of MERS. I mean, that's where the loan changed hands over and over again without legal transfer through the proper local recording channels. Listen, as a former senator, Ted Kaufman said, clear and uncontested property rights are the foundation of the housing market. I think Moody's, who really, let's face it, plays an enormous role in our current state of disrepair. I mean, they failed to do the very thing for which their company is commissioned, and that's to rate things. I mean, take a look. Moody's, we rate things. They tried and failed to acknowledge and rate the risk of all the loans that have and continue to fail at a historic and unparalleled pace. So, if they screwed this round of loans up after what they did the last time around, I mean, in my opinion, they lose all credibility and they cease to be a viable company. I know, it makes total sense. I mean, think about it. If you're a pitcher and you blow out your arm, what do you do? You stop pitching. Yeah. If you're a singer and you lose your voice, you stop singing. Right. If you're a cab driver and you lose your sight, you quit driving. And if you're a rating agency and you fail to rate, you quit rating. So, the position they're taking right now, right? In other words, Frank, mm -hmm. Moody's failure to diagnose the entire problem and take a position of, I don't know, nervous optimism. It might just be wishful thinking on their part. Yeah. In a move that might spell the beginning of the GSE's overhaul, President Obama has nominated Joseph Smith as a new FHFA director. Not that Joseph Smith. This Joseph Smith is the current North Carolina Commissioner of Banks and will remain in that capacity until March 31st. Analyst KBW have GSE losses at $200 billion, and some estimates are as high as $400 billion right now. That's right. It's their belief that the debt along with the $20 billion annual interest payment on their debt will be enough to wear out Fannie and Freddie, wipe out their shareholders, and lead to a complete reworking of the business model. You think? Also, Fannie lost $3.5 billion Ooh. and Freddie $2.5 billion in third <laughs> quarter. So, Mr. Smith, you <laughs> have fun with this one. And if I was him, I just pack my bags and head west. It's been done before. It has. Hey man, if you're gonna be in Vegas, say, mm, I don't know, December 4th on Saturday, we're gonna be there at Nam West. If you want some info on it, click the banner down here over on your right and show up. It'll be a good time, I'm sure. And I just gotta say this. If people want to come, they need to do it now because my liver can't take any more of this traveling. We're at the end of the year here, so listen to what he says. You guys have a great day. Subscribe for free. Forward all that stuff. We'll see you later. Think big. Work small. Bye. Cheers.